What's going on guys, welcome back to another fresh commentary. Now guys, Nintendo came out with a whole new Nintendo Switch update that provided every console out there with Bluetooth capability. Which means we can finally connect things like our AirPods to the Switch to play and hear our favorite games wirelessly. And this is huge because for the longest time since the console came out in 2017, this has been the most requested feature. Everyone has always wanted to be able to hear Switch audio wirelessly without having to plug in wired headphones through the 3.5mm jack. And for this update to finally fix that problem, Problem that we've had for so long is just a blessing. You don't know how many times I had to play with my Switch without sound because I didn't want to go through the hassle of connecting a wired headset, or I couldn't play off speakers because I was at a public place like on a plane or train. So this new Bluetooth update with the latest firmware is going to completely change the way I play on my Switch because now I can play on the go while being able to hear my games in public with my own wireless headphones. And it's kind of strange that Nintendo just made this happen with a simple update because that means the whole time since the Switch came out, the system was capable of having bluetooth support but nintendo just never made it happen after all these years which is getting a lot of fans riled up because i mean a lot of people out there bought third-party connectors and gadgets that will give the switch bluetooth capabilities and all for nothing because nintendo could have just improved the software we had to make our hardware have bluetooth so we can connect stuff like wireless headphones to our device and whatnot that means that nintendo isn't fully utilizing the switch's current capabilities in terms of hardware and it's getting fans pretty triggered because they could have just gave us this feature years ago but for some reason decided to make it happen now like who knows what else the switch can do it probably has some other basic features that other consoles have that nintendo just has been too lazy to make happen and this bluetooth update is a clear example of that this update if it were released say two years ago or even on release would have been really helpful or even benefited switch users too and resulted in more sales because people would have been like oh you can connect your wireless headset to this thing i want one so for them to just completely sleep on possibly one of the biggest features for the switch is so sad honestly i hope in the future they enable other basic features like bluetooth more ui customization options and more because maybe they're starting to realize how much behind they are with next gen and are trying to catch up and make minor improvements that in the future will overall make the switch a better console but yeah i just wanted to talk about this because this update really surprised and bothered a lot of switch owners like myself so if you enjoyed hearing what i had to say and want more switch videos then please leave a like subscribe if you're new i post videos here every day at 1 p.m est follow me on my socials like my twitch and twitter all links below and yeah catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Stay blue.